So you can't make something out of nothing, but what about matter out of energy? The Latin phrase creatia ex nihilo means creation out of nothing, and it's largely the domain of mythology and old episodes of Seinfeld for a reason. That's the first law of thermodynamics. Simply put, energy can neither be created nor destroyed. Now, how does that affect matter? Well, Albert Einstein theorized that matter and energy are interchangeable. There's a fixed quantity of energy matter in the universe. So when two protons collide in the Large Hadron Collider, they break apart into subatomic particles called quarks and a mitigating force called gluon. Even when matter and antimatter annihilate each other, they produce energy. If you were to build a molecule out of atoms, you wouldn't be creating matter. An atom is matter as well. It's like if you took flour and used it to make a cake. You wouldn't be creating food. Instead, you'd be taking one food product and building a more complicated food out of it. To manufacture matter in a way that adheres to the first law of thermodynamics, you'd first have to convert energy into matter. This conversion occurred on a cosmic scale 13 billion years ago. The Big Bang consisted entirely of energy. Matter only came into being as rapid cooling occurred. Slam some matter and antimatter together and you'll get an annihilation blast of energy in the form of photons, which are quantum units of light. Creating matter requires the opposite reaction, pair production, so-called because it converts the photon into a pair of particles, one matter, one antimatter. Laboratories such as Brookhaven National Lab, CERN, and Fermilab create this reaction by firing a photon into a heavy atomic nucleus. So yes, humans can manufacture matter. We can turn light into subatomic particles, but it's not creation out of nothing because it depends on the transference of energy into matter. So there you have it, it's a lot like a Star Trek replicator. And if you could fire up one of those replicators, what kind of matter would you like to create out of energy? Would you create some sort of uh, tasty food product? Or would you make something a little more nefarious? Let us know, we'd love to hear from you. You can leave a comment below, you can leave a video response. And be sure to hit that subscribe button so we can keep these videos coming at you.